Well, lots of people will be spending time outside this weekend as we celebrate the 4th of July. While you're outdoors, it's important to fend off those mosquitoes, even as the dry weather stays put. Kellan's Kelly Volk shares what you need to know this summer. People often associate mosquitoes with water, but these hot, dry conditions in Kelloland don't diminish your risk for West Nile. The mosquito that spreads West Nile the most readily loves intermittent water that dries up periodically in these drier drought conditions. And so it's actually of a greater concern to us when we have this dry weather. On top of bug spray, Becky Jaspers and her family take a few different steps to keep the insects away. We have a family member whose life was quite affected when she had West Nile. And so since we personally know someone, we're pretty careful and respectful of how serious it can be. While health program coordinator Denise Patton with the Sioux Falls Health Department says the Midwest typically enters peak transmission season about a week or two after Independence Day, it's possible to contract the virus now. Wear DEET all summer. <laughs> if you're going to be outdoors, it's just best to do that. For tips on protecting yourself against mosquitoes, be sure to click the link in this story on Kelloland.com. In Sioux Falls, Kelly Volk, Kelloland News. Right now, the city of Sioux Falls is spraying for mosquitoes in several neighborhoods, mostly in the western part of town. They plan to wrap up around 1 a.m. Now, they're also spraying the bike trail a few times a week. To receive notifications of when the city will be spraying, text the word SPRAY to 888 777.